Yo, boys. What up, Joe? Yo. I came up with the idea that we should play this great game today. Um, what is this? Surgeon Simulator, the first and original game. Oh, and what is so special about it? Trust me, Obama, you'll like it when you see what we are going to do. Look, Joe, are those your pills? Uh, we can see who laughs later, Trump. Bro, by the sound of it, I'm starting to get scared. What are you on? Come on, I'm curious to see what Biden is talking about. Yeah, hold up a second. These hand controls are weird. How are we going to play? We will take turns every time one of us fails until we finish the level. Bro, how do you even start? We have to press a button on this stupid remote. Then press it already, bitch. Who are you talking to? I'm talking to you, bitch. Okay, Donald, let's see. Your vote counts. Is Trump a gold-hearted hero or a stone-hearted Hold up, hold up, hold up. What is this shit? Look, Trump, it's you. Today, as I said, we have a special game. We're basically going to cut your heart and replace it with a gold or stone one. Isn't this game amazing, Obama? Oh, I love it, Joe. I didn't know such a game existed, but I'm all here for it. What the? Yep, here we have the United States flag, the most democratic, free, and best overall country in the world. And then we have Donnie. Aw, oh, look at him. Let me give him some slaps. Who's the bitch now, Trump? You are sick in the head, Joe. You are hurting my feelings with those words, Trump. Just look how I'm playing with your ugly ass head. Come on, man, really? Oh, hold up. Uh, I hate these controls. Yo, I think you have something in your nose. Well, Mao? There is no way I'm witnessing this. Whoever made this game is getting sued. You should worry about those other thousands of cases you got, bro, before you end up playing with us from a jail cell. All right, I think that's enough. Let's actually see what we have here. Bro, why is it saying that we are live on television? No, this is insane. Let's see what tools can we use in order to break those ribs. So we have a Trump Tower, a bottle of your vodka, and a present. Yeah, I think this golden axe is going to be the best option. Come on, Joe. I want to see how you penetrate through those ribs. I can't wait until it's my turn. Okay, Obama, so you are mentally ill too, got it. Ah, shit, my watch fell inside of you. What kind of doctor are you, bro? And why you can't even use an axe? You got that shit stuck in my rib cage. Can you please shut up and watch a master at its work? All the things I do are calculated. I just got to take it easy. Yeah, don't rush him if you want to live, Brody. Take it easy, and I already lost half the blood level. What, what are you doing, bro? What I wish I could have done in real life. Wow, that's so nice of you. How about you actually try to do that in real life so I can give your face an uppercut? Maybe after that, you'll be the next one sitting on that bed. Um, Biden, I think you should look at the blood level. Oh, shit, yeah, say your goodbyes to Donnie. Let me see. Maybe I can drug you with that good stuff. Why is your mind always thinking about drugs? You really a crackhead, Joe. Wow. Bro answered his own question. Oh, so you admit it? Who are you? The DEA's? LOL. Your mom. What? That doesn't even make sense. You stuck that syringe in every organ he has. I think you missed the... Oh, wow. He's gone. Thank you for choosing towns of your... Medical Center Hospital Donald surgery has been totally... Yeah, so in a shorter sentence, we smoke in your packle mouth. Noob plus ratio bozo. Damn, bro, you need some reading classes ASAP? Yeah, it's getting out of hand. All right, Obama, now it's your turn. Finally, I can cut Trump's lungs out. Huh? Don't worry, Donald, I will be very cautious with you, and I'm going to actually try to save your life. Don't worry, boys, I've already talked to my team. We are going to make a game named the Battle of Yemen, where Obama is on the field as a soldier, and another game where you will have to take care of Joe, giving him his pills every day, ice cream, taking him to reading classes, just like that one game, Poo. Good luck with that, buddy. If you do it, you might as well add 10 more years to your sentence, because I'm definitely going to sue you. What are you even doing, Obama? I was trying to see maybe I can turn off these things. Maybe you can turn on that brain and finish this game, because I already hate it more than I hate y'all. I thought that we were friends. Now you hate us. How can I not hate you guys? Look at Obama. He's been playing for a minute. And all he did so far was to slap me. He doesn't even want to finish the game. Can you shut up and stop crying? I'm exploring right now. Nah, he's right. If you want to explore, try to explore his organs. Okay, lastly, let me give him a sip of this vodka. Or actually, maybe you need it directly in your system. What are those headlines on the bottom of the screen? Trump, sorry losers and haters, but my IQ is one of the highest. And you all know it. Please don't feel so stupid or insecure. It's not your fault. What the fuck? I never said that. Yeah, because we both know from when we did that IQ test video that's on our channel, your IQ was lower than a dog's one. We all got a low IQ in that test. Stop hating. Okay, here we go. So as I said, I'm going to take it slowly because if we are doing it brutally, he's going to lose a lot of blood. And we don't want that, even though it's Trump. What do you mean, even though it's Trump? Do you see that medical bill down on the right? 
We're going to count that after every failure. And at the end, you'll have to donate that money to Ukraine. What? You're crazy. That is robbery. If I donate that money to Ukraine, it will end up in your pockets. Exactly. That's why I'm saying to do that. Bro, if you want some of it, just ask. You don't have to scam me. Oh, so if I want some of it, can I ask you for a small loan of $1 million? No, but I can help you with an ice cream machine. Maybe you eat enough a day to freeze your brain completely. That doesn't sound like a bad deal. Bro, you know what? I can't do this shit slowly anymore. I'm smashing these stupid ribs and I'm ripping your organs out. Thank you, bro. At least we get to finish this faster. We've wasted two minutes of our life watching you slapping me, giving me vodka and abusing me. And after all of that, you decide now that it wasn't worth to do it on a slow pace. Great. The slapping and abusing were just for you to get accommodated with the life you'll have to live in prison. Then you should take notes too, Joe. You know your ass is going to be there as soon as I'm back in the office. And what are you doing, Obama? You've cut my nose. Sorry. I think we've seen enough. What is going on at this point? Are you trying to stick the axe handle in his lungs? What? No, I'm trying to break that single rib that is left so I can get to his heart. Guys, you know that there were other methods of you getting to my heart other than actually physically trying to do it in a dumb game. Really? How? Um, I don't know. Let me think. Maybe if you get out of the office right now and let me be the president again, that would... Bro, did Obama just park that axe in my forehead? Um, yeah, it looks like it. My bad. You are terrible, Barrack. You have 300 milliliters of blood left. Good job. Thank you, Joe. Now shut up and let me take these lungs out. Uh, come on. Not again those headlines. Breaking news. Trump, I would bomb the hell out of those oil fields. I wouldn't send many troops because you won't need them by the time I got finished. Bro, that doesn't even sound like something I would say. Those are words you would only hear from Obama. Those are words you would only hear from Obama, huh? Oh, crap. I guess those were your last words, too. Oh, wow, thank you. Joe, read this paper real quick. Thank you for choosing Townsville Alpha Medical Center exactly, host. Exactly, Joe. Townsville Alpha. Just press the retry button. Okay, smarthead, now it's your turn. Good luck in transplanting your own heart. Thank you. First of all, what I want to do is to cover my face because I can't look at it while I do this. It's too weird. That's what Melania says to you every other night, huh? I'm better off hearing that than going to bed and meeting Thanos every time I want to sleep. Michelle is not Thanos, buddy. He's something close enough to that. And I think I'm close enough to call for a drone strike on your house right now. All right, chill. Let me use this thing. What even is this? A laser? Oh, no, nah, this is it, boys. I cracked the code on how to do this transplant easily. You better crack those ribs before I do crack. What? What? What did you just say? Nothing. This laser stuff really works. I'm breaking these ribs and no drop of blood has been lost. Take a look and learn. Yo, you know what I can't wait for? What? I'm very curious. Actually, I was asking myself this morning what Obama can't wait for. I can't wait till both of you have that presidential debate in 2024. I guess we'll see if it happens. Maybe people won't even vote for y'all anymore. But if it does happen, oh boy, I'm going to enjoy it. Earlier, Trump said that no drop of blood has been lost with his laser. Fast forward 10 seconds later and he's frying both of his lungs with that shit. Good job. Oh my. He doesn't shut up, and I lost all the blood. I hate this game. I hate this cup. I hate this steak. I hate everything. Chill the... Oh, wow, bro. Look, you have some scissors in your teeth. So not even Trump could have saved himself. And not even the FBI can save you from my foot in your ass. Okay, everybody needs to calm down. Joe Biden, the amazing doctor, came to the rescue. Okay, now, first of all, Trump was right. Let me cover this face because I don't need to throw up on his heart while I do the transplant. Second of all, let's get the golden axe. This is the thing I trust that I think can do the procedure flawlessly. And let's start with small steps, like Obama said. Barrick, what you said a couple of minutes ago about that debate, yeah, be sure that if it happens, it's going to be a great one to watch. I'm going to be the first president in history that is going to try a full mount chokehold on another president live on TV. Not even the Secret Service can stop what is going to happen, Joe, so be prepared. I'm always prepared. I keep that strap on me. I think both of you should have a boxing match. That would pull more numbers than Floyd Mayweather and Manny Pacquiao. And whoever wins gets to be the president of the country. Do you really want to see Joe go out like that? Yeah, you're right. Finally, bro, I got rid of these ribs and we still have left a decent amount of blood level. Now let's get to the lungs and then replace that heart. Wow, Biden, you're actually doing better than I expected. Thank you. Um, hello? Can you remove the other one too, Mr. Robinette? Now, if I were you, Biden, I wouldn't let that slide, but that's just me, I guess. Yeah, I can, Mr. John. Just a second, I have to slap you a little more like a bitch that you are. Oh, look at your dumb face. Can we continue with the procedure or do I leave Discord now? I'm getting tired. Let's see how we... Oh, shit, we've cut it. I mean, I've cut it. Whatever organ this is. That's the stomach, idiot. Come on, Joe, I'm losing blood fast. I know, I know. Let me put this knife down. You see, Trump, I've treated you well. I only use gold tools. Now I just need to grab this thing and get it out. Uh... Come on, I can't. 
Bro, just cut the heart at this point. Leave that stomach there. Okay, but in order to cut the heart, I need another knife. And guess what? I'm going to choose another gold knife, just that. I need to somehow grab it. Yeah, this is the difficult part for sure. Uh, come on. That's it. Here we go. You've cut it. Nice now. All you have to do is literally grab the heart, pull it out, and replace it with the new one. Did you understand, Joe? You can do it. Move your hand lower, grab it, and then up. If we fail this time, too, I might as well go ahead and throw my laptop out the window and go ask Michelle to make me dinner. Here, Trump, you can hold this, but don't eat it. Now let me grab the new one. I wonder how does he still have a heartbeat without any heart? And how does he still breathe without any lungs? Some insane performances by you, Donald. Very impressive. Thank you. You know I'm the best in everything, and I can do the impossible. What do we choose? The gold one. Yeah, I say the gold one, too. Before we do that, let me put a souvenir inside of you. Hmm, should it be the Trump Tower? Hey, weirdo, we're losing the blood level. Don't make me do the same thing Obama said, but only we change that laptop with you. This steak might be the option. Maybe you are hungry, so I'm gonna leave it there. 250 milliliters blood level left. Which one again? The gold one. Ah, shit. Here we go, boys. Are y'all ready? Um, can you do it and stop stalling before I turn this laptop into a Frisbee? Three, two, one. Finally. Thank you for choosing Townsville Land Medical Center Hospital. Your surgery has been successfully completed. Your heart has been replaced with one made of gold. A summary of your bill for hospital services is detailed below. Oh, that's light for you, Trump, $550,000. Yeah, do you remember what I said about where that money is going at? Biden, can you just shut up? I'm too tired of your bullshit, and I'm going to leave. But before I do that, I have to ask the people that are watching the video right now to please subscribe and press that like button if they like the video. Thank you, goodbye. Well, this was fun.